I'm Brenda McCabe. I'm an Associate Professor in the Department of Civil Engineering at University of Toronto. My area of specialty is construction management and it's an area that I find absolutely fascinating and I hope that I'm able to share that fascination with the students. Without a doubt, construction uh, is, a, is a big part of our, our, our urban environment. Um, if you take a look around the city, and certainly Toronto these days, we see construction everywhere. Everything from roads to subways to high-rise buildings. One of the more intriguing factors, I think, is the high-rise buildings. Our buildings are getting taller. We're starting to look a little bit more like New York City. And uh, there are certain construction challenges that are associated with those tall buildings. Some of the challenges that we found relate to the movement of people and materials up higher. So really we're talking about a very vertical movement. Typically we would use tower cranes to move materials up to the top of a, a building that's under construction, but tower cranes don't work very well with people, but also the fact that wind is very, becomes a, a stronger force the higher you go. And so you have materials swinging from a tower crane not very safe. So th that movement tends to be one of, one of the challenges that they have in the construction of very tall buildings. Some of the solutions that are coming up are innovative, including if you've seen in some cases modular construction where they're building concrete building blocks almost of completed rooms or, or units and then hoisting those completed units up. It doesn't solve the wind issue because now you have even something bigger that's going to be hoisted up, um, but it does reduce the timeline and the number of those that have to be lifted. The research that I do requires the input from industry. So we have quite a few partnerships with industry, whether they are developers of, of buildings, whether they are trade and industry associations, or whether they are the workers themselves. We have to get that interaction. We don't want to build models that are simply models for the sake of that, but actually can be used and have a practical value. So we outreach uh, often, or often they'll contact us with ideas that they have for research. And that interaction, I think, is what makes what we do a lot more relevant. I have a I have a weakness for cranes. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why. Um, that is a ringer crane and it is uh, unique in that it rests on the ground and has a very, very high capacity, but the entire uh, crane is able to swing around. And the only time I've actually seen it being used is at the Princess Margaret Hospital when they were building there. They brought in one of these in the back alley to help build the building.